everybody. Welcome back to RC Car Garage. And today, I am here with a project. <clears throat> so, as you guys know, I was working. I started a new project. I was going to start a new project with the uh, 1.6 scale F-150. Well, I have started it. I really haven't done anything body-wise. I'm looking at the body. It's right up there. But I really haven't done anything body-wise. I... Um, I'm starting with the interior so I haven't even done I haven't even started on the chassis yet uh, haven't I know what chassis I'm going to use but I haven't started on the chassis haven't done anything with it I really been working on the interior of that f-150 and I must say for what I've done with the interior of the f-150 I think it looks pretty good um, You know, I haven't really, unfortunately, haven't really posted too many videos uh, lately. Uh, hopefully, you guys like that last video that I posted up that just out of the whim. It came, I ended up buying it, came in the mail, and I said, hey, why not just make a video out of it? <laughs> Even though a lot of you guys probably know about the WPLs, that's actually my first one. So, but anyway. Back to the F-150. So I started on the interior. Let me show you guys what I did. All right, so here is what the interior of the F-150 looks like. As you guys can see, I went with a darker leather around. Yeah, this is leather, by the way, guys. So, I mean, leather. Like, I actually went out and bought leather. Doesn't say, but actually went out and bought leather for this thing. So this little strap you see right here, I actually had to. It was actually glued, if I remember how it went, but it was actually glued over here somewhere. Oh, there we go. All right. So it was glued up there like that. Let me try to get my fat fingers out of the way. So it was glued on there like so, where you see the black. It was glued on there. This part is going to go over to the side and be right back, right back there somewhere. Um, that's going to be the seatbelt. So I went with a darker brown um, on the sides. I went with a lighter brown here. As you guys can see on this one, move that. So on this one here, you guys are going to be like, oh, but you're missing, you're missing pieces there. I'm not. I actually did that on purpose because I have a driver that's going to go here. If you guys can see here, um, you guys can see that right, everything. This, this seat's done. It's just not done right down here. You're not going to see that. Once the dashboard goes in and everything, you're not going to be able to see that anyway, so it doesn't matter. Um, now the back, the bench in the back, I did the same with one piece going all the way across wrap to the back yeah <laughs> and I also wrap the back here of the uh, leather of the seat with the leather um, as you guys can see I did a side right here uh, did a side right here right here on shoulder right here also I went all the way down so when you're looking inside you'll actually be able to see it um, I'm thinking about doing something with the center console I'm not I don't know yet. I don't know if I'm going to do anything with the center console. I'm probably just going to leave it um, like this piece right here. I'm going to leave it that color. I'm not going to do anything with it. Uh, like this one here and this one back here. I'm not going to do anything with it. I'm just going to leave it that same color. So as you guys can see, I'm still thinking about what I'm going to do with the floor here. That's just a hole that's there. Like you can see I'm covering it with my finger. See right there so because that was actually one of these guys that was here and that one broke off somebody had actually posted be careful with this body because it's the plastics not as tough but uh you know i'm not planning on doing anything anything rough with it so let's let's see what happens uh but so the doors one of the things i was thinking about doing with the front doors especially 
I was going to have them open. But in order for me to have them open, I am literally, <laughs> it's not going to work. In order to get this, it's not going to work. So I'm not going to try to make that the doors open just for the main fact that the size here, I have to do a whole bunch of work here to end up getting at least from here, the B pillar, from the B pillar here, all this closed out. Um, granted, it would be, actually, probably not because it'd be with the door. But if you think about taking this part out here, just to open the door, I'm gonna have to cut the seat. And you guys can see the inside here. So right here is already where my finger is. That's already where this bolster is. So I don't really want to cut up the interior. I did it on the Hummer, on my Hummer H2. I don't want to cut this one. So unfortunately, what I wanted to do with getting the doors to open, I'm not going to be doing that now because it's going to be too much work that's going to have to get done once the door, once this part here is taken off and attached to the door and everything, it's just way too much work to end up getting that to work out. So I'm not even going to make the doors open. Um, again, like I was saying with the center console, I was thinking about doing something with the center console, but I'm not sure. I'm probably going to leave it as is, if anything. I'm probably not going to be doing anything with that. Because um, again, with the dashboard I have right here. So I'm not really, I was thinking about actually getting leather. Oh, here we go. <laughs> so you guys can see. I was thinking about getting leather and wrapping it, as you guys can see right there. But. Yeah, that would look awesome. I would really look awesome if I did that. But with me wrapping the dashboard, see, it has a, no, no, a nozzle, nile. I can't even talk. A knob. <laughs> it has a knob there. It has the air vent. It's kind of hard to see, but it has an air vent there. Hopefully, the camera it has this little thingy right there. Uh, the center ones is the same thing there, same thing there, a vent, a knob. This side just has a vent. Um, the other thing I could also do just to get, like, just the top here, I could probably just wrap the top here. Here we go. Okay, maybe not. Wait, hold on. I'm trying to get it so you guys can see. So I could probably just wrap the top like that, like the top of the cover. But then you end up seeing the edge of the leather right there. And I don't really like that. Um, I could do something like this. Just do it halfway. But then it's covering the vent. But I could probably cut it out but then the whole thing about cutting it out is that you're going to be able to see the back of the leather like you know something like that you're going to be able to see that I kind of don't want that so I'm going to actually leave the dashboard the way it is that is why I'm not really worried about how this center here is going to be um just kind of offsets with the color you know, so that's how I'm actually going to leave it. One thing I still got to do with this is the headrests. So I have the headrests that I still have to wrap. And what I'm thinking about doing with it is I don't know if I should go with the darker leather in the middle. That is going to wind up being something like this going to want to be something like this or if I should or if I should go with the lighter uh, leather here in the middle and then do the darker on the side let me know down in the comment section what you guys think 
Should I go with the lighter in the middle, darker on the side, or the darker leather in the middle with the lighter one on the side? I'm, because if I do it with the lighter one on the side, it's gonna match the side here. So, uh, but then if I do with the lighter here, it's gonna match this part and then the, guys, let me know down in the comment section what you guys think I should do. Darker leather on the main or darker leather on the side? Let me know down in the comments. Um, so lately that's what I have been doing. Now, with Christmas and everything, with the holidays and everything coming up, I haven't really been posting, posting any videos except for that last one that I was able to do. Uh, it was, I think it was like nine or 10 o'clock at night when I actually shot that video. And I, uh, when I did that video. So it was like nine or 10 o'clock at night when I did it. And, and whatnot. So, I mean, this is really the only time it's nine o'clock at night now and I'm making this video for you guys. Uh, so the other thing I actually did interior wise is a steering wheel. If you guys can see right there, I did that in a blue. Try to mimic the Ford steering wheel. Yes, having the steering wheel wrapped the same color as try to get the leather on here, that would look awesome. It's not gonna work though. I already tried, I already tried, and it's not, it, I mean it probably would, but I would, it would just, that actually would look kinda of cool. <laughs> Dang it! That would actually look kinda of cool, man. So, wrap the steering wheel. The problem with wrapping the steering wheel is I would have to do it in like a section, right? So I can wrap the steering wheel like so and just keep going along. But I would have to do it in a section. So I would do that area like this. I'd have to do an area like this, glue it, wait till it dries completely, another one, and then another one and then another one and just keep on going would it look awesome yeah it would look definitely look awesome um, I was actually supposed to wrap the seats in the Hummer with black leather I just decided you know what let me just spray paint it black and be good to go so that's how the Hummer ended up being I spray painted that black um, I don't think I have anything else. So I do have, I don't know if you guys remember, but right up there I had a Terramoto 10. Now with the weather being the way it is, we are in December. We're like a week or so away from Christmas already. It's like, I, I believe a week, wait, what's the date? I don't know, but we're like a week away from Christmas. Yeah, a week away from Christmas. I have plans for that Terramoto 10. What I'm planning on doing, honestly, is a uh, speed run. So I'm trying to get a speed run out of it. I want to see how fast I can get it to go. Um, with the tires that are on there now, those big tires that are on there now, I, um, I'm going to try doing a speed run with them. But I also might try to get some different wheels and tires throw them on there and see what they can do probably get some on-road tires and see what it can do the other thing that i actually wanted to talk about was with this guy actually so there's something else that i tried doing myself because that's just the type of guy that I am. I like trying to doing stuff. I like trying to do stuff myself before I ask for help. If I can't do it from the beginning, then I'll ask. But um, I try to do stuff myself. So one of the things that I recently did, I don't know if you guys can see right there, but I have stickers. I made a couple of stickers. Um, the first one I put on was on this guy because it was just right here next to me. So I put one on here. I, um, I'm 
currently in the works of making more stickers. So I'm thinking maybe at 500 subscribers, I'm thinking probably at 500 subscriber, uh, I will probably do a giveaway of a couple stickers. If anybody's interested, let me know down in the comment section. If anybody's interested in some stickers, at 500 subscribers, I will give away a couple stickers. Um, I will most likely probably pick five people, 500 subscribers, five people. Uh, I'll probably do that, and I'll give away a couple stickers to five lucky people if you guys are interested. So, uh, with that being said, I pretty much don't have anything else going on other than the interior of the F-150. Again, like I said, that is a long-term winter problem. Long-term winter project. Sheesh. Um, so yeah, that's that's what I have going on right now. That's, that's really it. I'm not working on any other projects right now. <coughs> Excuse me. With the way my desk looks, I kind of don't even have room on top of here to really start on any other project basically the interior for this Ford the interior for this guy basically with everything that I'm doing it took up all that room um, all the room on my desk so I have a small room here that I remember last year when I was making videos I was actually in my garage so when it was cold out I was freezing my little tushy off not too little but I was freezing my butt off down in my garage now I'm in my office where it's a lot warmer in here when it's cold outside a lot warmer so I'm actually able to and I enjoy being in here doing stuff so let me know down in the comment section guys if any of you are interested in stickers 500 subscribers I will be giving away stickers to five lucky people so let me know down in the comment section whether you're interested or not. And that's all I got. So we will continue this. And uh, so hope to see you guys in another video. Keep our seeing. More than likely, I'll probably make another video before Christmas. So I am going to. So I will see you guys in another video. You all have a good one. Keep our scene.